Hey everybody, Kratos Lucina here. Today we're taking out the Centuro 105, a uh, Italian tank destroyer. Uh, this particular one has the Rage skin on it. I have a lot of vehicles that have the Rage skin. And what's weird is, like, I don't really remember the campaign that gave me the Rage skin for a lot of these vehicles, but I have it, so, you know, <laughs> and that's kind of my personal policy of if I get a unique skin for a vehicle, I will immediately put it on. And, and if I don't have a unique skin, I do that, uh... That Enigma gray construction looking nonsense. Just because it's a camouflage that it looks the same on all of the terrains. Because there's a lot of camouflages where there's like a special variant for desert, forest, and uh, uh, desert, forest, and snow. But this is one of the few tanks that, uh, oh, come on, load one more. That's all I got to do. There we go. All right. Uh, that gray Enigma skin I usually use is the only one that, that I've found so far that remains static across all the camouflages. So that way I can, you know, kind of use it for everything. I really hope this Geppard kind of pulls up where he can get a good view down that lane. <laughs> I'm hitting everything over here. The rate of fire on this thing is ridiculous, and I have a feeling I'm going to run out of ammo <laughs> before this match is over, just because I'm going to sit here smacking the crap out of this, all these tanks. Is that the back of the Digman? Oh, that is such a weird-looking tank. Haha, <laughs> yeah, ten points. All right. Boy, that was a slaughter right there at the beginning. Man, look at all those busted-up tanks. Now the next task is to try to, ooh, okay, uh, okay, whoop, all right, let me just casually kick flip off the top of that rock. Mm, no, thank you, sir. All right, I wonder if I can kind of peek up around here. Oop, all right, let's... What is going on here? Uh-oh. I will wedge myself into a glitch. All right, that's not going to work for me. Oh, man, this... <laughs> that's a problem. Ah, crap! Well, that didn't work out for me. Didn't think I'd get stuck on that, uh, on that rock. It's kind of the downside to having wheels in this game is while you are fast and can really just go zipping across the map, you're let down by a, uh, by the fact that you just can't steer your tank anymore. Or, like, you can't, like, pivot steer and, you know, do fancy maneuvering. Oh, 
That TADU just got slapped hard. This leopard over here just doesn't want to die. If I can just do this. Works for me. Just keep picking on this leopard until it finally dies. I'll just explode. Ooh, swing and a miss. All right. <laughs> Ooh, I did it. Whoa. Whoa. Oof. Come on, one more reload and I can kill this thing. Oh, that was crap. I hate when this game does that. You're like, it's like down to a level that you're like, I know my shell will kill this. I My shells always do over 500. And then you fire the shell and the enemy's at like exactly 500 and, you know, just like that uh, stingray. And then you fire the shot and it does 497. You're like, come on. Okay, so I think part of my problem is that there's a VT5 hiding around here. And that's not good for my health. Yeah, it looks like that one. Haha. <laughs> Final kill's mine. Look. There I am, taking over the whole base. See, I don't get this. Like, every now and then, so, like, I'll do this mission. I'll get the audio, but it'll be, like, a static image. And then other ones, I get, like, this floating camera pan. No audio whatsoever, because... She's supposed to be saying a bunch of stuff of, you did it, you captured the base, and now we're going to make it to where we can make more oil for our, you know, for the ISD or something. I can't remember what the full text was, but, you know, big long spiel that matches th the length of the pan. And, and then other times you get the static image, and she gives the message. So, there's little bugs in this game, but they're not bad. A lot of people tend to complain about them, but I don't think they're significant enough for me to care. All right. Oh, man, look at Silver Platter. That's probably like two more missions. That one will be done. Beefed up the long-range attack by a few. Cumulative Strike is getting up there. Destruction's going to take a thousand years to complete. So I like... This one I gotta do, let's see here, what is it? So, 1,080,000, and I'm only up to 127,000. I'm just gonna go on for a bit. All right, I hope you enjoyed this, uh, this particular battle. Uh, please uh, like, and, like and subscribe if you haven't, and thank you to those that already have. I appreciate it. Uh, I will see you guys in the next battle. Until then, have fun.